What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in the box? Oh, what could it be that's hiding in here for me? What's in the box? What's in the box? Is this a model kit or what's in here for me? What's in the box? What's in the box? How hard is it to put together? Is it made of leather? Hey, what's in the box? What's in this box? What's in the box? Today's episode of What's in the Box was filmed right here at Monster Hobbies in High River, Alberta, Canada. Hello once again, welcome to another episode of What's in the Box. And this is a special episode because we just got a new delivery from the Games Workshop. Three big boxes. And I don't even know what's in the box. Well, of course I do, because I ordered it. But anyway, you don't know what's in the box, so let's open these big three cases up and find out what's in the three boxes. Our adventure begins with box number one. <laughs> this is the smallest box I've got from Games Workshop. And we'll open it using my old Scout Knife, 1986. Okay. Oh, what could this be? Ooh, look, it's something that I don't know what it is. Oh, there it is. Oh, okay. <laughs> we have Battle Tomes. The Dominion of Chaos Battle Tome. And we have the Chaos Dreadhold Battle Tome. These Battle Tomes I got specifically for the store. But that's okay. Oh, look. This is not for the store. This is for you guys. Space Marine. Coda, Codex Adeptus Astatis. Space Marines. And then I got... These are restocks. The 40k rule book. For all you guys that want to play 40k. And there's the three books there. The rules. Dark Millennium and a Galaxy of War. All exciting for you. Let's see what's in the next box. Our adventure continues with box number two. So now we come to the medium sized box, which I will open with my scout knife from 1986. Okay. What is in here? Okay, packing foam. All right, we have some Auric Armor Gold paint, which was a restock. And we have some Lead Belcher paint, which is a restock. You will find these paints on the paint rack. And here's some Abaddon Black. Okay, let's get to the neat stuff here. This is also restocked. Space Marine Tactical Squad coming back on the shelf after a leave of absence. And a second Space Marine Tactical Squad. So now I have the recommended two for the shelves. And then what's this? Chaos Warriors in the brand new box with the round bases ready for your Age of Sigmar battles with the new paint charts on there that work with these paints, which you will find on the shelf. And over here we have the Necron Warriors with Canoptic Scarabs. And a Space Marine Assault Squad. And what is this? Chaos Space Marine Squad. And finally, we have a second Dark Vengeance set to get you started in your Warhammer adventures with Chaos versus the Green Guys. <laughs> Sorry, I completely forgot what they, they're called. The Salamanders. Anyway, there you go. So now we go on to the next box. Our adventure concludes with box number three. So, here we have box number three, which I again will open again with my old scout knife. 
this is the biggest box we have. Now look, I don't need to cut. Oh, sound effects. Sound effects department. All right. And we have some more packaging foam. Oh boy, look at this, this is great. What is in the box? Start collectings. We have a Space Wolves start collecting box. And we have Astra Militarium, formerly known as the Imperial Guard. I should keep this one, but no, I must sell it. Anyway, you've got a Lehman Rest in there. And the Commissar. Don't turn around. The Commissar's in town. Demons of Nurgle start collecting. Is this cool or what? Corn Bloodbound start collecting. The Orcs 40k start collecting. Look, it comes with the the Death Dread. Okay. Oh, we have the Militarium Tempestus, which is the updated Imperial Guard. Oh, look at this. Dark Eldar start collecting. That's neat. Ugh. Demons of Corn start collecting. Okay, this is gonna be fun because I gotta reach further in the box. Hopefully I can get this out. The Eldar 40k start collecting. Stormcast Eternals start collecting. Blood Angels start collecting. And you get one of the Blood Angels, uh, Bale Predator. That's pretty cool. Looks like I'll have to start collecting those guys. No, maybe not. Chaos Space Marines. Look at the dreadnought with the arms. Oh, did you notice this? There's a salamander head on the pole there so that you could do this, add this to your, um, what is it called? Dark Vengeance set. So there you go. There is Skatari, start collecting for the mechanized guys. And what do we have here? Tau Empire, start collecting. Lots of battle suits in there. Space Marines start collecting. How can you not collect Space Marines? Everybody loves the Space Marines. There's Necrons start collecting. Look at this crawling spider. What do they call that? Triarch Stalker. That is cool. Start collecting that. Oh. And we have a Tyranid start collecting. Just in time for Christmas season. And last but not least, the Seraphom. Start collecting. You get a huge dinosaur in there. So I hope you enjoyed this episode of What's in the Box with brand new items for Monster Hobbies coming up here. You'll be able to find these on our retail shelves for their recommended prices. So come on down. Check it out and yeah, start collecting. Start collecting an army up. And we can play it on our glorious tables out here in Monster Hobbies. So come on down, like us, subscribe to us, write in the comments what you might want me to open up next in what's in the box. And if I get new items like this, I'll show it to you. And you guys will hopefully like what I brought in. So come on down, check us out. Our store address is Unit 42B, 11th Avenue southeast in High River, Alberta, Canada. Our website is www.monsterhobbies.com and our Facebook is Monster Hobbies in High River, Alberta, Canada. And you can phone us at 1-403-652-5019 and don't forget to leave a message because we get a lot of calls throughout the day and some of them are actually robots wanting us 
to buy something. <laughs> Which sounds like my show. Anyway, I will talk to you later and enjoy.